What's going on everybody? So real quick before this video gets going, got something very, very big and exciting happening right now. So this little logo right here, that's the mini logo for my company that I'm starting up, which is called Adrenaline Off-Road. I've already registered that name as a business and everything, and it's mine. Exactly one week from today, I'm gonna be opening up my online store. And so for right now, what I got on there for you guys is two decals and a t-shirt, and I'll show you guys a t-shirt right now. You guys ain't even ready for this. Check that shit out. Life's too short for no mods. And then there's the little mini logo right there, Adrenaline Off-Road. So you guys are gonna be able to cop this t-shirt next week as of November 2nd. So mark that down on your calendar, guys. It's been a big process for me to get everything in order and going. I didn't cheap out at all, you guys. I guarantee you, anybody who orders this t-shirt, it's gonna be one of your favorite t-shirts because it's so comfy. It's something I've been wanting to do for a long time and I'm finally just going for it. And following my dreams and see where it takes me. I have a feeling that these t-shirts gonna be moving fast. So many people have been asking me about merch and stuff all this time. And also the two decals that we have. One says Dodge Ram Fam. For all the Dodge lovers and people who drive Dodges out there, of course. And then the other decal that we got out says No Road, No Problem. I'll just put pictures of them up on the screen right now. These are stickers that I've personally wanted for a long time, so I just went ahead and made them. So hopefully I can see a lot of you guys repping the decals yourselves. So anyways guys, enjoy the video. And next week, November 2nd, do not miss it. All right guys, so we have a little project coming up for you guys. Me and Danny right here. You guys know Daniel, he's the guy with the Cummins. Made a video with him one time in the past. And uh, yeah, so we got this 1999 Chevy Tracker right there. Standard. And you already know we're gonna be building this thing up and we're gonna just take it off-roading and just burn it to the ground. Oh my God! <laughs> Oh yeah, you got it all mapped out already, eh? Yeah, we're gonna have to cut the wheel walls. Just gonna take tires. Just gonna take a fing sawzall to that or what man? Uh sawzall. <laughs> like a grinder or something. Yeah. Oh my god, it's gonna be a great video, bro. So yeah guys, we're gonna be transforming this thing. We're trying to not spend too much money on it and just kinda make it just like a total mess around vehicle oh, yeah, for off-roading and stuff. Yeah, just a total bush beater. We'll be doing multiple videos. And each video, we'll, we'll just do like a series or whatever, and each video we'll just do something new to it and kind of just get it ready, and it'll just be a little project vehicle for off-roading and whatnot. We're gonna put some hockey pucks underneath <laughs> for our, I don't know, two, three inch body lift. And then you can get a two inch suspension lift for this too. So uh, it'll look pretty sick, I think. So we'll probably have like four or five inches of lift on this thing, and Plan on putting 31s on it, right? 31s or something like that. I've got a spare set of Toyo Open Countries like you have on your truck. You could fit uh, 37s maybe, <laughs> if it's high enough. Leave a like if you want to see us put 37s on the Chevy Tracker right here. Yeah, We're just going to do a quick flex check just to make sure she's good to go. Got some good suspension under there. <laughs> We're here in the shop right now, and right over here we got a whole shit ton of cats, cause you know Daniel just loves cats so much. He just likes to keep keep a couple hundred on hand at all times. Diesel cats that I fucked up on, cause diesels don't have cats. Yeah, he See, got he, DPFs. He, he admits his faults. Okay, but okay. A DPF and a cat is the same thing. So yeah, uh, this is where all the magic is gonna be happening, right? Pretty much. Yeah, well, we're not gonna be using a frame machine, but we got the boys. We're gonna do some serious work on that tracker. Who even knows what we'll do to it? That's perfect, man. We're just set up here. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be a sweet build series. Oh, baby. Are you serious? Pro Tom. Bro, we're putting those on the tracker? Extreme MT Triply. Yeah. Extreme. What's well, it? If it says extreme, you know you're good. Oh, you know you're good. You're good to go, yeah, man. To There's Bay what? looking in the distance. Hey, don't get that big bad tundra in there. Get the tundra in there? 
Hey, hey. Looks like it has a small lift on it. Thank you. What size of lift is it? Just three. Three inch lift. So the tracker is going to be sitting higher then? Yeah. Oh yeah, bro. I don't even know what they are. It doesn't say. It'll 285s. Say. 285s, those are just basically 33s. Ribs here for something. Oh boy, look at that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, she'll fit. Just make a nice slice. Just a small upgrade from what's on there right now. Sheesh. 75 Us running a scrapyard. We've got some unique items here. Uh, we've got this little GMC 3500. 3500. I don't know if that's the actual door for it. So, but, uh, so this is basically like a one ton then, right? <laughs> yeah, but it's got a really short frame on it. My dad calls it the midget. And um, we've also got an oh. ambulance. Oh, an ambulance. Yeah, I've got a couple people that want to buy it, but nobody's actually going to pull through. <laughs> Matt, do you think anybody's like ever died in the back of that thing? Maybe. That's kind of actually, I've never thought about it. <laughs> <laughs> so if anybody wants to buy an ambulance, holler yeah. at this guy. <laughs> you ever think you're having a bad day at work, man? Look at this guy though. Poor taxi driver. Oh my god, bro. Rest in peace, diesel tips right there. I know, that's Big time, I eh? I thought mine was bad. <laughs> Poor baby is dead right here. 285, so. Shit. What the hell? Well, that one. What happened to this f toe man? Bro, it looks like the haters got to this toe mirror. <laughs> <laughs> they couldn't contain themselves. <laughs> yeah, no, this one's actually the truck that I've had that we took all the lift and everything out of. So that's why it's on the ground because it's got no suspension at all. It's yeah. a real low rider. Is the engine still I, good? The engine's still good, yeah. Should we swap it into mine? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yes. But like the inside's pretty gutted too. Oh yeah, bro, she's mint. <laughs> Just everything everywhere, eh? Yeah. No horn. Just done. I think we're gonna have to put these things on the tracker too. Yeah. Just throw a couple flares on. Only on like one side though, hey? Yeah. We got three. <laughs> we got three. <laughs> Dude, we have to put the exhaust tip on there. <laughs> we, imagine that thing on the tracker. <laughs> it's just straight pipes. Yeah. I think we might have to just throw on the Cummins logo. Do these tires, man, that tire doesn't even have air on on the other it's side been though. It's sitting forever. 285, 75, 16s. So we could throw these on there too then. We got a few options for This tires. got more tread than the other ones, I think. Oh yeah, and then the Pro Comps, definitely. We're gonna most definitely be trying to fit 37s on there. Even if, if we can, yeah. We even... Find a 17 inch rim that fits the uh, tracker. There's a lot of websites that'll be able to tell us what'll fit. So uh, <laughs> that'd be sick, it'd be unreal. We're gonna be trying a lot of stupid shit with this build and just completely messing around, I'm not taking it too seriously or anything like that and just making something just wild. Let us know what you think about the uh, hockey puck body lift. <laughs> <laughs> you ever done one of those? If you have, give us some tips or whatever. And I'm trying to figure out how high we can go with pocky pucks here. <laughs> I wouldn't go too high, man. I think two pucks would be our limit. Two puck limit, hey? Yeah, I've never seen anybody do it. I've heard of people doing it, but I've never seen it done, so I want to experiment with it. <laughs> yeah, make our own little homemade fabricated hockey puck lift. Yeah. Be good to go. <laughs> it'll, it'll be golden. Pure golden. All the way to like yeah, the first you? mod right there. <laughs> Another thing we're contemplating doing, maybe just a uh, couple stacks straight out the back. What do you think, man? I think it'd be a great idea, man. Just like, roll, roll, roll. just right at the back of the roof there. Just put a couple stacks coming up for exhaust. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. just, uh, <laughs> looks like antennas, man. Like bunny ears. <laughs> straight, straight, straight out the hood. Stack. Just out the side. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, she's gonna be just a monster. Okay guys, so I got a new mod in my truck right now, and I know lots of you guys are gonna hate on it. I honestly don't even care what you guys think, because I really think it looks nice, and you just, you're just jealous. All right guys, so check out the new mod here. You ready? Boom. Oh yeah, guys, check that out. Cummins logo. I'm a... I'm a fan of the Dodge Cummins, so why not put it on the truck, right? I know lots of you guys are gonna say, like, you don't drive a Cummins, why would you put that on your truck kind of thing, but it doesn't really matter, like, it's, they're both Dodge, right? So it doesn't matter. <laughs> no, just kidding, these are Daniels. Yeah. Man, your I, face is red as hell right now, bro. I'll make it white. As soon as I get my baby back, she's going right on. She's at the shop right now. I might have a f cylinder. 
<laughs> I'm gonna have to beep that out, bro. <laughs> I know, but uh, so she's getting taken apart. They're gonna scope the cylinders and figure out what's wrong with it. If it is a cylinder, depends how bad it is. Well, we might bore it out and just put it all back together. But if it's too bad, we might have to swap it with the uh, another five nine that you saw over there. Yeah, so he's having the problems with his Cummins right now. That's why he didn't put on the new logo yet. So he's got to figure that out. Cummins is down, bro. Cummins is down. Yeah, I know it's so sad. Shit. But, uh, whatever, it'll it'll get done. All right, guys. So that concludes the first episode of that build series. So next week's video is gonna be of me and my buddy who has a Duramax. We did a tug of war together, and we also went off roading a little bit as well. So that's gonna be next week's video with the release of the t-shirt and the website and everything So make sure you guys do not miss that it's gonna be a hype week next week in the next build video in this series We're gonna be doing the lift pretty sure the body lift so comment down below if you have any ideas for the build and chances are We'll probably do it. So I want everybody to have a great week this week and look forward to next Thursday because it's gonna be awesome guys See you then Imagine how much hate I would get if I just put one of those in the truck, okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. One of the videos. Yeah, I'll pretend like I actually.